First up for The Rock, Emily Kometko. It's hard to believe, but at this time last year, Emily Kometko was training at the YWCA in Fresno, California. First big time meet, that's a lot of pressure. Does she even have a shot at making the national team? Realistically, probably not. It's going to be all she can do to keep her nerves in check. That's okay, no worries, we'll get the next one. Up for the rock on beam, Lauren Tammy. Lauren Tanner finished 10th at last year's Nationals. A lot of people are expecting her to medal this year. Well, she certainly has a shot, but the judges are going to be looking for a lot more personality than she's showing them right now. Kelly Parker on bars, Pace and Keeler on deck. Is there anyone who can seriously challenge either of them for this year's national title? Honestly, no. I mean, I just don't see anyone ready to step up to their level. So, you, your back is hurting. And I hear you're the new cover girl for hemorrhoid cream. Congrats. Good luck. You too. Healer. That should be good enough to put her in first place on day one. Still early, though. Anything can happen. Next up on Bean for the Rock, Kaylee Cruz. Let's go, Kaylee! Bring us home the gold. Bring us home the gold. Now, Kaylee Cruz is always a crowd favorite. Now, she is one of those athletes that know how to entertain an audience. Is that going to be enough? Well, you know, Kaylee has kind of plateaued this year. If she ever dug deep enough to get the grit to match her glitz, she could surprise a lot of people. Now here's the dismount. Payson's final skill of the day. Will her lead hold? Ooh, that will probably knock Pace and Keeler out of the top spot. There's a score. Yes, Kelly Parker will be the leader at the end of day one. The last athlete of the day for The Rock, Emily Kometko. This is a new routine for Kometko. Her coach, Sasha Beloff, changed the music on her just about a week ago. And in all honesty, she still doesn't look comfortable with it. 